Hey guys, welcome back to another video on van life theory. My name is Alicia and today I'm going to be talking about van life organization. Hi, we're Alicia and Jared and welcome to another episode. Join us as we travel around Australia in our Sprinter van, Mali. Subscribe and let's see what this beautiful country has to offer. So today I have 10 tips for you. Number one is drawer dividers. I love my drawer dividers. They're absolutely amazing. Things don't move and break. We just got these from Ikea. They fit perfect in our drawers and it keeps everything snug. Number two is boxes. So we have lots of different storage boxes everywhere. We have them under our sink. We have them up in our clothing area. We have them everywhere. It helps out and organizes the van because we keep things in one place. So if we need to get something behind it, we just pull out one box, put it down, grab something behind it and put the box back. It just makes it much easier and much tidier. You can get all different sizes of boxes. I recommend the flimsy ones like this because then, for example, if your van is round, it can actually fold round like that so it can shape the way your van is so definitely recommend ones that are softer these are like a felt type material and they're so awesome number three is collapsible bowls i love them okay so i have a strainer which is also a steamer and a strainer but it folds down to this thin which is awesome for the drawers I actually have a big bowl which I use for my mixing bowls, things like that. And then it folds down to a very small size as well, which I keep in the cupboard. And then my last one is containers. So I have an airtight lid for the top and then these containers go down to a small size for the drawer as well. It helps out with space in my kitchen cupboards. I highly recommend collapsible containers, bowls, anything anything you can find that's collapsible will definitely save you space in the kitchen number four is make a home for everything so we know where everything lives in our van we know that when we leave for the day and we're getting ready in the morning we know where everything goes everything has a home and it gets put away it just makes the van feel much more tidier and organized and we know that when we're driving things won't fall over and break because they're in their home and they're snug so make sure everything in your van has a home. Number five is label on top of the cans. If you've got a bottom drawer that stores food, label on top of the cans. I did that earlier on and it's made my life so much easier when I'm looking for a particular item in the can. So I just label on the top what it is so it's easier when I'm looking down to grab whatever I need. Number six is use every space in your van, even behind the front seats in the front, under the seats, anywhere possible you can find, even above the front seats. A lot of people don't use that storage above the front seat, but there's so much space there. You can use it to store whatever you need up there. It's empty right now because I emptied it out, but it can hold a lot. But the only thing is it needs to be lightweight stuff because it's not the sturdiest, so you can't put heavy items up there. So just light items. Another thing is when everything has a home, if you don't use it regularly, you forget where it is so make a list of where things are so we have a lot of storage under this side here and i have made a list of what's under there of our camping gears i know exactly where it is when we need it and i'm not pulling everything out to find this one thing another one is roll your clothes like this this is what i mean by roll your clothes you can fit way more in it just makes things much more easier after we do our laundry we roll all our clothes put them in here and then slide them that roll your clothes it's a big tip for you the next one is vacuum bags because we are traveling around full time we do have the winter months as well which is a lot colder so we have extra blankets the blankets are pretty thick so i was trying to find a way to compact them so i found the vacuum bags unfortunately we don't have a vacuum cleaner so we just do them by hand and it actually compresses a fair bit obviously if you had a vacuum cleaner it will compress even more it's definitely great it compacts our uh, blanket and then when we need it in the winter we just pull it out the last one is take as little as possible when you are packing your van right at the beginning go through everything and just decide whether you're going to use it or you're not going to use it how many times you're going to use it or if you think you're going to use it take it with you and then mark how many times you've used it there's so many times that we thought we would use these items but then we never did so we've taken note of that when we stopped off to visit family we left these items behind because we just know we're not going to use them 
from that point on so there's no point in them taking up space in the van so we leave them behind so really think about the items in your camper van what you're going to take and if you're going to use it regularly or not there you go you guys that's my 10 tips for van life organization if you have any tips or you have any advice on the way you organize your camper van please leave in the comments i'd love to know and i'm sure other people would love to know as well leave a thumbs up if you like the video or subscribe that would be absolutely awesome as i'm bringing out videos every week and thanks for watching guys i'll see you guys on the road bye